Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do a reading for Sagittarius. This is for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for the first two weeks of April, so April 1st through the 15th. Keep in mind that the timing is fluid, not every reading is for you. We got this money going down the drain, but it is reversed, so I'm not sure if you're going to be getting some money. You could be getting some money, uh an increase of money or something like that or you're just saving your money there's something to do with money here it looks positive okay so if you've been waiting for money the money is coming the money is coming what do we have for Sagittarius Libra you could be dealing with a Libra during this time 444, angel protection, universal protection, all is well. This is also a card of justice being served. So I'm not sure if you've been, you know, this is the balance being restored. I feel like you are about to get some sort of justice or you're about to get what you deserve. Maybe it's in the form of financial uh, gain. It feels like it is some sort of financial gain. Highest intuition. Things are about to change. Your life is about to change. This I don't know if this has to come from a death or something. If something has ended, but you are about to get what you deserve. It is positive. Okay, it is very positive. Um, listen to your intuition. Listen to your gut. You have the answers inside of you, or you are. You have a lot of wisdom. Pay attention. Really pay attention. Um, you may need to look a little bit deeper at a situation. I feel like um, you have a higher knowledge that you may not be aware of. Um, this is this is a very uh, it's a good omen. I think that we have a good omen here. I th I think that you have some sort of universal protection that is bringing you uh, justice and whatever it is that you've been waiting for. You are going to get something that you have been waiting for. And I feel like you know it. I feel like your intuition is spot on. I feel like um, typically owls, they symbolize, it's a Native American, I don't know, maybe it's folklore or something like that. It symbolizes um, carrying somebody to the afterlife um, or, or helping somebody to transition and it doesn't have to be an actual death transitioning from one phase of your life to another you are going through a transition it is positive okay it is positive your life is about to become more balanced out more uh, well it's balanced you're about everything is going to turn out as it should okay so if scratch I feel like there's there's been a lack of financial abundance in your life I feel like you have gained this all happened for a reason you may have been struggling for a reason maybe you needed to uh, grow spiritually and when you have all of the abundance it can tend to stop your spiritual growth anyhow I do feel like you have ascended from one phase of your life to another and you are going to be receiving some sort of abundance because it's time okay this is a time of transition for you and it is a positive transition okay I know that it is and I think that you know that it's coming I feel like you are you're a, it's almost like you have an old soul energy and I've said this before you are um, highest intuition is what I want to say your intuition is of a higher level especially during this time so really pay attention okay so what do we have for Sagittarius you've gained a lot of wisdom through an unjustified situation put it that way all is well all is well all right this all happened for a reason
Princess of Wands reversed. So that's the Page of Wands reversed. Page of Cups reversed. And Two of Wands. Now Two of Wands is a decision and it is it is positive. Um, a definitive decision is being made and I do believe it's being made in your favor. Okay, I think you're dealing with some people that are malicious. It may be two people. I feel like you're dealing with people that are probably, I don't know if they're jealous of you or they just want your money or something like that. You're dealing with somebody, especially one or well, both of these people, but you have somebody around you that is very greedy. They, they are cold, uh, malicious, vindictive. I feel, I feel like, uh, you know, you got somebody that, or you, and I think it's two people. There's revengeful people around you. Okay, liar. It, it could be one person. I think you're dealing with a liar. Um, somebody that is nasty. Okay, the, these, whoever, if this is one person or it's two people, you're dealing with somebody that is very mean-spirited and aggressive and um, they're, they're, they're trying to bring you down. Somebody is trying to bring you down, and you need to not let them bring you down. Be confident. Be strong. Okay? This person may be causing you some heartache. They're causing you some sort of grief, and it's because the, it's because they don't get attention. They're negative. They have a negative mindset. You know, this person... Um, you're dealing with somebody that is emotionally unavailable. They lack emotion. That's what it is. They don't. They lack emotion. They don't care. They don't. They don't care. And I feel like they're. They, they, I don't know if they're after your money. They're using you for money or something like that. But I think this is where things come to a stop. I do think that something is coming to a stop. And I think that, you know, I don't know if this is a legal issue or the legal system is getting involved or or something like that. Maybe there's a legal contract. Somebody is trying to. Um, lie they're trying to lie but i don't think it's going to work out there's lies here it feels like you're dealing with a drama queen i feel like in the past you've been let down Maybe you've been let down by a relationship or you've been let down by a person that you thought was on your side. A decision is going to be made in your favor, just so you know. I think that somebody, maybe this, this is like heartbroken. It is with the Page of Cups reversed. And you may be doubting, you know, you may be doubting that you're going to get the, this payout or you're going to get this job or you're going to get what you deserve. You, and I see your doubt, okay? The decision is going to be made in your favor. I feel like there's a higher, there's universal, this is angel protection, universal protection. I feel like, I feel like you are protected. I think the decision is, is going to go in your favor, whatever this decision is. You, you know, there's two choices. Whatever this is, and it, anyway, the decision is going to go in your favor. Queen of Wands, yes, that's that's your energy. You, you are protected. This is you. You are. You are protected. Your nobility, your valor, who you are, how you handle things, to hold your head up high, be proud of what you've accomplished. Your strength and your determination, your perseverance is going to pay off. You are going to be, you are in a position of power right now. You may not know it. You probably have to turn your back on somebody. I have to tell you, I mean, you got somebody here that is emotionally unavailable. So you have to make a decision. You have to make a decision. You obviously have two options here. I feel like, I feel like, you know, 
you have to turn your back. You may have to reject somebody. You may have to push somebody away. This person is negative. You're dealing with a negative Nelly. They're very pessimistic. They cry all the time or something like that. They may have a victim mentality. You're dealing with somebody that is infatuated or they're an insincere or they're greedy or something like that. You've got somebody here that is uh, immature for one thing. They are definitely immature. They don't, they don't think like, they don't have a lot of wisdom. This could be, you know how I said you were an old soul? You're dealing with a young soul. Okay, you're dealing, you're an old soul, you're wise, you have a lot of inner wisdom, you know, you're dealing with somebody that is, I don't know if they're materialistic or what, this is a, this is a young soul. And I feel like this person um, is trying to take something from you with that, with that money going down the drain. They're trying, but they're not going to get away with it. It's not theirs. They're not going to get away with it. They're going to be stopped. They're going to be stopped. And I think there's universe. The universe is stopping them. And I say that because of this 444. You are protected. You are. I feel like you are going to be sitting in a position, a good, very, very good position. You are going to get exactly what you deserve. But you are going to have to turn your back on somebody. You absolutely are. This person, you need to set boundaries with this person. Whoever you're dealing with is obsessed with their image. It's not you. They are. They're obsessed with their image. They're not, they're not doing this for all the right reasons. They're doing it for all the wrong reasons. I think that you have a lot to be proud of. And I think that you are about to get justice in regards to... Or a decision is going to go in your favor in regards to an individual that you have been dealing with that is very negative in your life. This person never has anything good to say. They're helpless. They're always a victim. You're dealing with somebody who plays the victim. They have a victim mentality. Anyhow, I think that you are... transitioning away from this person and I think that you are expanding yourself you're going to be expanding you may be building a new foundation someplace else fours are about foundations also you need to pay attention to the signs you really really need to pay attention to the signs with the four and the owl card you are receiving messages from above and from your intuition and from your gut. Do not doubt them. Do not doubt the messages that you are receiving. You are receiving clear messages. I feel like you're going in a new direction. I do. And I think that uh, you've been dealing with somebody that is un insincere. Very insincere. But you're about to soar. You know, I think that you're about to soar way above this person. Um, moving. Walking away. I just want to be happy. You may be moving. You may be traveling. There's expansion here. Traveling, moving, making a spur of the moment decision. This is a spur of the moment, spur of the moment decision, focusing on the future, expanding yourself, taking charge, taking the reins, finding your discipline to walk away from some sort of hostile situation. I think that you have been in a very hostile situation. You have this five of swords. Reverse. That's extremely hostile. This is like choosing, you know, I just want to be happy. I just want to be happy. I don't want to fight anymore. And that's the overall outcome. Okay. That's moving. 
okay you're moving away from something you know your your gut is going to be probably telling you that it's time to get in the driver's seat that it's time to go that it's time to move on it's time to deal with this opposition you are definitely leaving something behind you that isn't serving you anymore this has probably cost you a lot of money I feel as though you're going to be focusing on yourself. You really are going to be focusing on yourself. You're going to be laying a new foundation someplace else by the looks of things. I think that you have been having a hard time making a decision, but I think the decision is going to be made. Or you've been waiting for a decision to be made, and the decision is going to be made. All right? This is the end of a battle with the Five of Swords reversed. There's been a lot of hostilities. I think it's over. I think that, you know, I don't know if there's also some crime being exposed with that five of swords reversed. You know, I there, we have somebody here that has been looking out for number one, not caring who they hurt. This person um, may be getting caught. You think of that Libra card, that's justice. The law may be getting involved. I do believe there's going to be a transition. Absolutely there is. May have something to do with a vehicle as well. Somebody could be packing up. They could be going somewhere. But there is. It, this is a time of transformation and it is a time of change and transition. Things are about to change. And I think they're going to change fairly, fairly quickly. You're going to get what if it's money that you've been waiting for or you've been waiting for freedom. You've been waiting for a victory. The answer is yes, you're going to be victorious. You are. Whatever is happening, it's going to go in your favor. You know, I feel like you've been in a very sad place. Maybe you've been feeling lonely. You've been having a lot of doubts that you were ever going to, you know, get out of this situation. You are going to get out of this situation. You have to turn your back on somebody that is controlling. I think that you have somebody here that is controlling. They have a victim mentality. This is a I think that you're dealing with a know-it-all. I do believe that you are going to get some sort of vision. Okay? I think you're going to get a vision, and this vision is going to guide you away from somebody. You may have a conversation in a vehicle that changes everything. Something to do with a vehicle here. We have a vehicle, we have a car, you know, where maybe there's an maybe there's an accident. I'm not sure what it is, but it doesn't really look like an accident. We definitely have a vehicle here. You may be in your car. You may be in your car and you're driving along and you get this vision. You get this you get this intuitive intuitive nudge, you know, you get this uh message okay it's a message from your angels or it's a message from your guides or it's a message from spirit this is going to uh whatever this message is it's going to move you away from somebody it is i feel like it's going to help you to make a decision that you have been struggling to make and it's almost like you see it instantly it's like oh my god i can't believe it you know it's like an epiphany and I think you get it while you're in the car. I think that you have... Uh, it feels like you've been waiting. You've been waiting for the right moment. You've been waiting for things to change. You've been waiting for, to get what you deserve. You know, and I think the time is now. What is this Five of Swords reversed? Leaving something behind. You're going to be leaving something behind where there's been belittling. I feel like you've been belittled. It's almost like you've been abused by somebody. You know? This is like, I'm walking away from this. I'm not going to be abused. There is revenge here as well. Somebody has been revengeful and vindictive. They're jealous of you. 
I don't know if it's another fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, could also be a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, could also be a Libra. There could be a fight, okay, there, there could be, there could be a fight, this could be war that causes somebody to leave, that helps them to make a decision that it's time to leave, it's time to move. Either way, I do believe that you are going to uh, be in a position of a power because it's, I do, this is a very powerful position that you are in. I think that you are in a powerful position and I think that um, you are protected. You're protected by the universe. You're protected by angels. There's spiritual, there's spiritual guidance here. There's universal guidance, universal protection. Um, I do think that this month or during these two weeks that you are going to be on fire. You're going to be on fire. And you're going to be seeing things. You're going to be receiving messages. You're going to be glowing. You're going to be happy. You're going to be leaving that distraught feeling behind. Because whatever it is that has kept you confined, I think that you're going to be breaking free from it. And you're going to get whatever it is that you that you are waiting for. Somebody is trying to take it from you. They are not going to succeed. There is a higher power that sees your nobility. They do, they do, they do. So anyhow, um, some of you are going to be traveling. You may be traveling. You may be expanding yourself. Um, you could be going back to somewhere. You know, you're going back. Could be going back home, wherever that, I don't know where that's coming from. Um, either way, you're going to be getting a lot of intuitive messages this week, or these two weeks. The, pay attention, really, really, really pay attention, because these messages that come from within are going to guide you down that path. You have been asking where to go, what to do. The message is going to come to you this week. There's signs. Pay attention to the signs. Maybe even a road sign. Change is coming. It is. This battle that you have been in is coming to an end. This is a time of transition and transformation. You will have a victory. So if you have been worried, consider that a worry. You are going to be victorious, whatever this is. Good luck.